these shoes, so let's check out what's included in the box. We open the box. Oh, look at those. Here they are. These are a size 11. Um, you could use them kind of as a sneaker or as a water shoe. Um, they're probably built more as water shoes um, with a grippy surface. Let's take a sock off and try them on. So I am typically a 10 and a half. And let's see how they fit. Oh yeah, they fit nicely. Um, my toe stops right here. So they're probably a little bit big for me. I would say if you're buying them, they fit true to size. This toe box area is a little bit big. I could cinch it down, but as you guys see, it's gonna kind of bubble up like that. So I would say get your size. Um, if they don't have your size, then may not fit you quite as well as you want. Um, but I could tighten them down like this and make it work. Yeah, like not bad, but again, if you have a choice, make sure you get your size because they do seem to fit pretty true to size and then you don't have to worry about this area bunching up and your toe will actually, instead of stopping there, go towards the tip more, which is what you want. But overall, they're pretty cool shoes. We did get them as a gift, um, but it's not affecting our review of them. You're seeing for the first time as we are too. And then on the bottom, pull them off. They have a nice track, uh, grippy traction base. Now it looks like there's actually even spots for water co to come out of them. As you can see, they have little holes there too. So this outside part is rubber and they have kind of like a soft covering here. So maybe if you're wearing on them on a boat or something like that, they would help um, not mark up the surface too bad.